Good morning, my name is Dr. Ken Anderson, and we're here at the Anderson Center for Hair. We are live, and I'm going to talk a bit about how we start our robotic surgical procedures. And we're here, uh, we're here with our patient, Jason. How are you doing today, Jason? Good, great. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to be doing is taking the tensioner and applying it to his scalp. And the tensioner, I'll bring it towards the camera here. It's essentially a grid with special markings on it and tiny tines on the bottom to make sure that it grips the skin well. And the purpose of the tensioner is to place tension on the skin so that when the punch from the robot comes through and uh, uh, extracts the follicle, the skin doesn't buckle and the follicles don't get transected. So come on in. Come on a little closer and what we're going to see here have a good look at the scalp here. It's a good, uh, you know, a nice rosy pink, and you can see when I press my finger on it and take it off, it it blanches for a second. See that? And what we're going to see after I place this tensioner is it gonna, it's going to be blanched on the inside here uh, as a result of the tension placed uh, by the tensioner. So that we're going to put the first grid right there. Go ahead. Okay, very good. Does that hurt, Jason? Not at all. Okay, and then we're going to kind of bring it north a bit and strap it in really nicely with the... And then, of course, you want to check to make sure it's nice and flat and achieves a planar surface for optimal graft extraction. Now you can see the... the, the color of the skin inside the tensioner is much lighter than the pink skin on the outside because of the tension placed by the tensioner. And we're going to check the tension. I have a durometer here and we're going to take a little glove and put it there and check the tension. And we've achieved 45 pounds per square inch of tension with the tensioner, which is an excellent number. I like to see it above, above 42, 43. We're going to take a tiny needle and just make a couple of injections here. And again, Jason's scalp has been completely numbed. You feel okay, Jason? Great. Don't Very fun. good. Very good. Okay, so that looks fantastic. And what I'm going to do now is use the robot control fob, and we're going to bring this is the six jointed robotic head. And it's got uh, a couple of stereoscopic cameras inside this robotic head that allows it to see. It allows it to measure the angle and obviously the location of the individual hair follicles. So we're going to bring the robot head into position now. This is called center position. And then what I'm going to do is kind of bring it in manually and just kind of place it right there. And then I'm going to press a button and it's going to orient itself to that grid. And then let me see this one second. We're going to just want to show the viewers the business end of the robot. So what we're looking at there are the two stereoscopic cameras. They're kind of looking at you like eyes at the top of the screen there. And then the, the uh, white LED lights are there to light up the surgical field. And then, of course, we have the surgical punch ready to go. In terms of what else we have in the operating suite, here at the Anderson Center for Hair, we've got the microscopic dissection stations. This is where we count, sort, and trim all of the follicles. Every one is accounted for. We want to be very accurate. I've got the monitor. This monitor is exactly the same as, as what I'm looking at at the surgeon's user's interface. Got a couple pictures from the last two artist users meeting and some of my college art on the wall. This is the surgical cart that has all the tools we're going to need for today to really perform the procedure. And then this is the, the surgeon's operating station where I sit and control the robot. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'll have you just hold the camera right about right about there. And I'm going to take off my gloves and we're going to go ahead and 
extract a few grass. Okay, I'm going to start with one, Jason, just to kind of get you used to the sound and make sure you, I assure you that it does not hurt. Here we go. Did that hurt? Not at all. Okay, we're going to do about nine more in a row here. And I'm Okay, we're going to stop right there. I'm going to raise 40. I'm going to put some gloves on. We're going to turn on our Star Trawl LED surgical lights. Nothing but state of the art. And you can see the tension even stops the bleeding. So there's very little bleeding coming from this area. And I'll just extract one graft for the audience. And there you can see a beautiful graft a nice follicle. We're going to go ahead and put that in the dish. Very good. Okay, so we're going to be doing about 2,500 of these today. We'll turn off our Star Trawl light. And I uh, wanted to thank you for joining us for the start of uh, Jason's uh, robotic surgical procedure today where we're going to be extracting and transplanting about 2,500 hair follicles, uh, which equates to about 5,600 hairs. That's a lot of hair. So it's a big day. So with that, thank you very much for watching. This is Dr. Ken Anderson at the Anderson Center for Hair.